Some people around you feel they have to be careful about what they say and do. Why do you feel that is if you are not a cult leader? <laughs> Why do people have to be careful about what, uh, what they say and do around me? Well, I don't know why people feel like they have to be careful about what they say and do around me because I'm not careful about what I say and do around them and I encourage everybody to just be open and truthful with me about what they're saying and doing. However, I do understand at times that people become afraid of hearing the truth under certain circumstances. I am a person who is willing to state exactly what I feel at all times with every single individual that I interact with. Now, most people who interact with me after a certain period of time, they go through this period where they start feeling like, what's he going to say next? What's the next thing that's going to be challenged? What's the next truth that he's going to tell me that he believes, you know? And so what they do then is they start being a bit afraid. Like they start going, well, do I want to go up and speak to him or don't I? Like if I go to speak to him, what will he tell me about myself that I don't want to hear? What, what you know, what, I might get angry with him and how is he going to act then? And, what, you know, and they start questioning their own behaviour with me and as a result they become afraid in their interaction with me. But that's their own emotional stuff. I don't see it as my issue. All I see it is I am willing to state the truth and be honest and open in every single interaction with every single person at every single time I can possibly be. I attempt to do that with as much kindness as I can muster because I feel a feeling of love towards the people who I'm stating the truth to. If a person comes up and asks me a question, I will state what I believe to be the answer at the time. If I believe they don't want to know the answer, I'll say, I don't believe you want to know the answer. Many people find that confronting and so some people become afraid of me as a result. I don't feel there is any need to be afraid of me. As Mary and other people who know me more intimately know, I'm just really a, a, a ver like a cuddly teddy bear <laughs> who uh, has a lot of love for people but who is just different in this one aspect and that is that I'm willing to state the truth in every interaction. So I believe that for the majority of people the main reason why they are afraid of me if they are afraid of me and I suggest to you that majority aren't but any person who is afraid of me is 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 primarily afraid of me because they're just afraid of what they might hear from me and uh, and if that's the case my suggestion is don't have an interaction with me then I'm perfectly okay to not say anything um, and just feel my love for the person rather than saying anything I don't feel the need that I have to share any information with a person unless they ask so my, my feelings are address the emotional issue of fear and then we can have a decent straightforward interaction.